Wi-Fi is a wireless connection which allows you to surf the net in all areas of your home or office without the need for any cables. So, how does it work? Wi-Fi uses radio signals, similar to those used by wireless home phones, to send data between your modem and computer or other wireless devices. SSID refers to your Wi-Fi network name. WPA refers to your wireless password. Without a password, your Wi-Fi network is accessible to anyone within range of your wireless signal. That means they could potentially change your modem settings and use your data. To protect your Wi-Fi network, it's important that you set a strong password that no one else can guess. How do you change your Wi-Fi password? You will need to connect an Ethernet cable between your modem and your PC. Then log into the modem gateway. Open your browser and into the address bar type 192.168.1.1 or 10.1.1.1 and then press enter. While these two addresses are the most common, it may vary depending on your modem. Check your modem manual to be sure. For TPG supplied modems, go here. Log in with your modem gateway username and password. This differs depending on your modem, but the default username is often admin. And the default password is usually admin or password. Refer to your modem manual if you're unsure. Once you're in, you can change your Wi-Fi details or keep the default settings. Refer to your modem manual for specific instructions. To connect to your Wi-Fi, select your Wi-Fi name or SSID from the list of available connections. This is done differently depending on what device you're using. Here's a few common ones. For a computer using Windows 10, click on the Wi-Fi icon on the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Find the name of your Wi-Fi network from the list. Ensure Connect Automatically is ticked and then click Connect. Enter your wireless password, which may be printed on a sticker on the bottom of the modem or it may be your TPG account password. If you have forgotten your password, you can retrieve it here. For a computer using Mac OS X, click the Wi-Fi icon in the top right hand corner and then select your Wi-Fi network. For Apple devices using iOS, click on Settings, then click Wi-Fi, and select your Wi-Fi network. In Android, tap Settings, and then tap Wi-Fi, and then select your Wi-Fi network. If you can't see your Wi-Fi network on the list, make sure the WLAN button on your modem is pressed and that the Wi-Fi light on your modem is lit. Wi-Fi removes the need for cords and cables, making it more convenient to use your devices anywhere in the home. Ethernet, or wired, still offers advantages though, with faster speeds, lower latency and no wireless interference. Typically, a Wi-Fi signal will reach up to 30 meters. However, there are a number of factors that may interfere with the signal. Here are a few things you can do to give your wireless signal the best chance at reaching your devices. Location. The more walls your wireless signal has to pass through in order to reach your device, the weaker the signal. Place your modem in a central location. Interference. Keep in mind that electrical devices such as cordless phones and microwave ovens can weaken the Wi-Fi signal dramatically and sometimes disrupt it altogether. Network channel. 
With so many people making use of Wi-Fi networks in their homes, there can be congestion or interference. Changing your Wi-Fi network channel can sometimes improve your connection. See your modem manual for instructions on how to do this. Wi-Fi password security. To prevent unauthorized access to your Wi-Fi network, always ensure your password is hard to guess and change regularly. Devices. To prevent additional congestion in your home, turn off connected devices when they are not being used. If you're still experiencing signal dropouts or speed issues, there are a couple of third-party accessories you can try. Wi-Fi Signal Extender. A Wi-Fi signal extender will help produce a clear signal if you have a large area to cover by relaying your signal over a longer distance. Powerline Network Adapters. Powerline Network Adapters enable you to set up a home network quickly and easily. Using your existing household electrical wiring without the need for additional cabling. For more help with modem and Wi-Fi setup, go here. For help with internet connection or speed troubleshooting, go here.